हेलो माय डियर फैमिली मेंबर्स आई होप ऑल ऑफ यू आर प्रिपेयरिंग वेल फॉर योर अपकमिंग कैप्जमिना एग्जाम टुडे आई गॉट सो मच रिस्पांस फ्रॉम योर साइड दैट यू नीड कैप्जमिना लेटेस्ट क्वेश्चंस सो दैट्स व्हाई आई ब्रॉट सम रीसेंट क्वेश्चंस विद आंसर्स व्हिच आर वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट फॉर योर अपकमिंग ड्राइव बिकॉज़ दिस टाइप ऑफ क्वेश्चंस विल बी आस्क्ड टू यू ओके सो लेट्स स्टार्ट विदाउट एनी बक बक ओके so before that guys if you have not subscribed yet then please subscribe this channel and watch the playlist regarding any open that you want and if you want the prime materials then please dm me at my insta id instagram.com/techno.tf the materials is paid just cost 69 rupees you can just use the upi id given in the description box and send me the screenshot at my insta id instagram.com/techno.tf i'll give you the materials okay so let's go to the questions so the first question is regarding yeah all the questions will be from dsa so because uh, in computer fundamentals the most questions will be from what the most of the questions will be from dsa okay dsa and network and then yeah and then some csc based questions okay so the first question is considered an array of integer a a is equal to this array i mean this array okay so a function named mean takes an array as a parameter and returns the minimum element of that array okay find the value of the following expression minimum of a0 plus minimum of a1 okay so this is one array okay there is no like outer curly braces let me give it so if this these are two array if these are two array inside one array okay so what will be the answer for this expression minimum of a0 plus minimum of a1 so a0 means this full array and a1 means this full array okay so minimum of this array is what 1 okay as you can see one is present here and minimum of the a1 is here present one okay here also it is present 1 so if we add this then this becomes 1 plus 1 that is 2 so correct answer will be option a okay so let me go to the next question so sorry the next question let me just yeah so the next question is consider a stack of integers the stack is allocated five memory cells stack is equal to 1 3 3 then 2 underscore then the question is the following operations are performed on the stack okay push push and pop and there are certain elements are entered so what will be the item value this is the question what will be the item value so before i give the answer just let me tell you i hope you guys aware of this that total 18 uh like pseudo code questions will be asked to you and then total 15 mcq questions from technical they will ask you okay so this 15 questions will uh, consisting of like uh, dsa then networking then some cloud based question okay so you have to give importance to all of these but still dsa part from this 15 will be like game changing okay so i hope you will guys give importance just remembering you once again if you want the prime materials of capgemini in which i have included all the recent questions with answers all the coding questions pseudo code cloud based network based questions with answers and also mock test then please dm me at my insta id instagram.com/techno.tf this is paid but very affordable okay so i hope you will guys uh, like dm me okay so in this case what will be the correct answer as you can see this is stack okay so what stack follows that is lifo format stack follows lifo format okay that is last in first out okay so let's say this is stack this is stack so at first one is uh, like we have post one here then we have post three here okay then we have post the three again here then we have post four we have post four then we have post 10 okay we have post 10 then the pop operation has been done so these are all in okay these are all in now it is time to out last in first out so these are all in that is push but when will pop that means out 
the last element will be popped out that means this element will be removed okay so 10 will be the correct answer okay so i hope you guys understood so let me go to the next question so the next question is regarding consider an array s of integers s is equal to this array the following operations are performed on the array okay so duplicates are removed then second operation r is 4 is appended then 1 is appended then 2 is appended duplicates are removed then calculate the sum of all the elements of the array so if this is the question just you can imagine the answer or you can just write it down to your notebook okay for your understanding so at first the operation is duplicate are removed so here elements are 1 2 4 3 and nothing are there so 1 2 3 4 will be that like uh, after removing these elements will be there okay 1 2 3 and 4 then operation is 4 is appended so if 4 is appended then 4 will be here then 1 is appended then 1 is here then 2 is appended then 2 is here then after that duplicates are removed again so 4 4 oh, sorry 4 1 2 all will be again removed okay so 1 2 3 4 will be left out so duplicate uh, sorry calculate the sum of all the elements of the array so 1 plus 2 plus 3 plus 4 that is 10 that will be the correct answer guys as i have explained that's why it took some time but you have to understand that at first you ha you have duplicate like you have removed the duplicate element so at first you found quickly that is one two three four are the duplicates element then you appended four appended one appended two you know that one two three four already present so four if i appending this then don't consider it because already here there is a operation that is duplicates are removed so one is appended two is appended so these are all you don't have to remember it okay so at the end duplicates are removed so that means the earlier will be same as this okay so calculate the sum that is will be equal to 10 so let me go to the next question so the next question is consider a tree t shown in the diagram what tree that is the tree so this is the tree this is shown in the diagram as you can see question is calculate the number of descendant nodes of the root node of the root node so this is the root node okay so 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 11 12 13 14 15 16 then 8 17 18 19 20 so total element will be 20 okay so i hope you guys understood so let me go to the next question that is which of the following verticals vertices have no siblings d and l m g and c the yeah this is the diagram so which uh, uh yeah which vertices have no siblings so just pause and try to give the answer sorry the diagram is this so as you can see d have siblings because his father is this parent is this and his sibling is present here okay then option is l so as you can see l is present here and parent is his g and the descendant is f so f and l are siblings okay to each other so f sorry d and l removed okay d and l removed then g c m g c m so for g for g e it has like four three brothers brothers or sisters okay so it is removed so c it is also removed because it has also three brothers and sisters apart from he or c okay so only option left to it that is m it has no siblings okay no sharing parents so that means option m will be the correct answer so let me go to the next question that is calculate the degree of root node in the tree root node of the tree so for this case what will be the degree of the root node so i hope you guys know how to calculate the root no uh, degree of root node that is you have to count the edges okay you have to count the edges so here one two and three okay so count of edges three so degree will be three okay nothing else so as they have mentioned that you have to calculate the root of the node okay so 
uh, sorry, degree of the root node. So option C will be the correct answer. So let me go to the next question. That will be a quiz question for you. So let me show it. So this is the quiz question for you guys. So this is the array and from the given linear or array representation of the binary tree, find the parent of seven. So I hope you guys will give the answer in the comment section. So this much uh, I had to discuss with you guys today. So I hope you guys enjoyed this session. And again, if you guys want the prime materials of Capgemini, Deloitte, Accenture, Cognizant, or any company that you want, then please DM me at my ID, instagram.com slash This is paid but very affordable. Okay. So thank you for today's session.